Welcome to the video guys. This is just going to be me unboxing my monthly Carzilla order. I got my cold beverage on hand which I'm going to keep outside of the frame because you know YouTube and their demonetization policies are pretty strict so and all this is is basically just me casually unboxing my monthly order from Carzilla.ca and I usually I don't know I spend about $150 a month because you know, I don't have to justify it to anybody. Why not? I work hard. So if I want to spend $150 on car detailing supplies every month, even though clearly I don't need it, I'm going to do that. And I don't have to justify that to anybody, right? But anyways, that's neither here nor there. So I'm going to unbox it. I'm going to do this once a month, usually after month end. So the first or as close to the first of the next month as possible, because that is, like I said, after my month end. Hopefully I don't ramble here too much, but let's get this unboxed and see what we got. Got my little unboxing knife here. Comment down below if you know what knife this is. My By far my favorite unboxing knife and EDC knife. So let me know in the comments if you're a knife person. So let's get this unboxed. I guess I'd, like I said, I spent roughly about uh, $150 plus tax on this order. And it's actually been sitting there for about a month. Two weeks now and i've kind of forgotten what i got so let's put that away because it has my name on it my personal name that invoice we gotta keep to the side for tax purposes and right off the bat this is how they have it packaged Ooh, that's gone There's a whole bunch of this stuff to recycle Like I said, I hardly remember what I ordered, but I guess we're going to find out. I'll try to lay it out all over here. My workbench is a mess right now, so I'm not going to show it. A bunch of extra tr trigger sprayers, a little pump. There's a chemical resistant trigger sprayer there. Put those to the side. So first of all, we got the uh, 32 ounce bottle empty bottle of brake buster and that's what the gray uh trigger spur goes with so it's a chemical resistant combo there and if that wasn't foreshadowing there is our gallon of brake buster i've never tried brake buster before but i figured i've seen a ton of videos on youtube about brake buster i know that it's a good product so i didn't want to bother with one of those dumb little like one of these guys here, the 16 ounce bottles, because that's just a waste of money and I hate those bottles. So I decided to go straight for the gallon and then the 32 ounce empty bottle there. That's a way better choice if you are interested in getting something like this. Review video coming soon. Surprise, I've actually never uh, reviewed this product before, but it's just never been on my, uh, in my cart. And I've always liked the Atoms and, you know, a couple other products, but it's just about time that I try this product. <clears throat> one good thing about Carzilla is they always ship their chemicals like this with a little piece of tape that prevents this from coming apart. So the last thing you want is you want to unbox your order and this is all undone. So with a little piece of tape there, it's a small little thing, but it does make a difference. And I really do appreciate that. Part of the reason why I chose Carzilla.ca to use as my affiliate program, which I have been doing way before, sorry, I have been a customer of theirs way before I ever became an affiliate because I actually believe in them. They're really, really good. In my opinion, one of the best sources of car detailing supplies in Canada. Customer service is unreal. This little bottle here that is like super wrapped up, as you can see, I'm struggling just trying to get all this crap off of here. Ooh, interesting. I don't know if I like that. So that is NV Nova Jet. First product by this brand. And the reason I went and had and decided to try this for the channel here was because, you know, Sandro from, what's that come? What's his, uh, shoot. Oh my God. What is his uh, YouTube channel called? Whatever, I'll edit it in, I for completely forget now. But his YouTube channel is unreal. And if Sandro recommends this product, then I'm definitely gonna try it. 
So we've got Nova Jet to try out, see how it compares to other products. And that's just a hydrophobic spray coating. Tons of these around in the market. Pretty much everyone makes one now. So curious to see how this product does against the other ones in the market. Let's put that to the side. Carcraft. Oh my God, it's Carcraft. Jeez Louise. And then I went ahead and I got uh, these from the right company. And it's just a bunch of clay scrubbers. And leaning more and more towards uh, this type of product instead of your traditional clay bar. Of which I actually have tons of them, including this clay magic one. And that's some nostalgia there. But I have a ton of clay bars. So it's so much easier to go ahead and use a clay scrubber like this. Because... You don't have to knead it all the time. Yes, you're gonna add some micro marring, but that's gonna happen with the clay bar as well. So really excited to try that out, see how those go. Let's put those to the side. This is gonna be a fairly unedited video, guys. So maybe I'll swear in this video, who knows? I hope not. Ethos, Pro Shine, and this is a ceramic detail spray. I actually ended up picking this up because I wanted to do a head-to-head -head comparison between this product and the Turtle Wax Pure Shine, which I made a video about a little while ago to see which one can do better. I have uh, two other Ethos products now, so this will be a good comparison to see how this stacks up. And who knows? Maybe it might be my new detail spray, or maybe it won't. Who knows? Take all that tape off, that Carzilla ships. That's what one of those extra trigger spares is for. They always ship it like this with the, the cap on it and then the trigger pair, trigger sprayer separately. Appreciate that. I think that might be it. Let me take a look. There's a lot of packaging in here. Tons of this stuff. Fill up my recycling bins. What do we have here? Okay. I almost forgot I bought this. So CarPro Dark Side. It's a tire and rubber sealant. And take a look there. It says three plus months of durability. And always a little skeptical when it comes to uh, durability claims on any product. I'd rather test it out myself to see how it lasts in my environment compared to what they say on the bottle. Which is almost like... When a car manufacturer advertises miles per gallon and you know they've tested those in the best of conditions to get the best possible miles per gallon they can possibly achieve. I always think of that when I think of um, any company that puts a durability claim. Sure, maybe in the best circumstances, three plus months, but... Uh, Usually companies will put up to three months. These guys actually put three plus. So that tells me that this should last at least three months. So it'll be interesting to see how that goes. I'll make a video about all these products and that's usually what I do. I'll usually post videos about uh, most of the products I buy and most of the products on my channel are purchases that I've made with my own money because I'm not sponsored by anybody. So I pretty much just buy whatever I wanna buy and then I make a video about it, right? And if you want, you can support the channel by using my discount codes, my affiliate links, blah, blah, blah. And that just goes to support the channel. No extra cost to you. And I usually use that money to buy more detailing stuff like I have here. But more and more now, people are starting to send me some products, which is pretty cool. I never expected that. If you are somebody that wants to send me something, I'd say follow me on Instagram send me a dm on instagram and that's probably the best way you can reach me i used to put my email out there or an email i made up for this channel and i find that i'm just getting spammed all day long by like weird gaming um, companies that want me to promote their shitty games to i don't know people that like car detailing videos it just doesn't make any sense but there's so much spam that i can't really trust and determine what's real and what's not. So one last thing here, uh, mostly everything I bought or paid for is right here in front of you. The box is empty other than they really do pack it with a lot of uh, shipping material. But something that Carzilla likes to do is they will give you a detailer sample 
if you reach a th certain threshold of dollars spent. I'm just taking the tape off of it here, but check this out. So they sent me Car Pro Inside dedicated leather and car interior cleaner. So a little 50 milliliter, 1.7 ounce size of that. So that's pretty cool. I've never um, never really looked into this product on my own. So be curious to see how it is. Well, that's pretty cool of them. That's got to be at least a 5 to $10 value at the very least. All right, so part of the reason I always purchased from Carzilla before was because one, they always, they clearly take care in how they ship the product to you in that they tape the uh, lids with their little clear tape so you're not going to have any spillage. But you also get, you, 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 you'll get their points, you'll get their um, free product if you purchase a certain amount, and you also get free shipping after a certain dollar amount as well. Not only that, but before I became an affiliate, I was actually under the impression that their only affiliate program was that you share your little code or you send a little link to people that you know and you get like a certain dollar amount off and they get a certain dollar amount, something like that. But I thought that was their only affiliate system and I used to actually send that to my friends all the time and say, hey, if you want to get car de detailing supplies, go through these guys because they're freaking awesome. And anybody can do that. And then they're like, oh, no, we have an actual affiliate program. And I'm like, sweet. But anyways, that's a, enough rambling from me. We're already at 12 minutes here. So that's what I got. Brake Buster. The Ethos. Um, I forget. Pro Shine. Car Pro Dark Side. This is the one I'm most excited about. The NV Nova Jet because of Sandro. A little free product there which i did not pay for they sent that as a detailer sample which is sweet and then these ultra clay scrubbers which i can already tell they're pretty much like any other clay scrubbing mitt that i've gotten before so same thing different shape not too exciting there but uh yeah overall that is my april order and like i said i'm going to be doing this at least once a month usually sometime close to the first of the month um because that is after month to end i work a fairly stressful job and i figured if i want to spend 150 dollars on detailing supplies i will spend 150 dollars on detailing supplies and i don't have to justify it to anybody but like i said thanks for watching the video this is not an algorithm booster by any means whatsoever it's just a video i wanted to make so let me know have you used any of these products that you see here do you have any recommendations? There's going to be review videos coming out of pretty much all of these products. So comment down below if you have any suggestions when I test each of these products out. If you want me to test any specific aspect of those products, let me know now in the comments so I can actually add that to my review video. But other than that, um, I appreciate you watching. Like I said, check out my affiliate links in the description below. If you do choose to support the channel, that is the best way to support me or pretty much any uh, YouTuber that you like to watch. You can support us by clicking our affiliate links down in the descriptions and it doesn't cost you any extra. You can go ahead and buy whatever you're gonna buy anyway. So with that being said, cheers to you if you have your favorite beverage of choice alongside with this video. I will not show it on this uh, video here out of fear of demonetization. So great, eh? Anyways. Take care and I'll catch you on the next one.